Hello, I'm Drew Bertha with Mox News. What do you know about Islam? Students who attended MSA's event this past Monday can't answer that question. UTC's MSA hosted an event to inform students who were interested in Islam. What do you know about Islam? had many students come to view the four speakers on their topics. The president of MSA, Abad Shahid, gave us more details on the event's turnouts. Uh, really hectic, but uh, we, we got all the speakers here, and uh, we, it's, I, I think it's, a, it's been a good turnout, which we were, we were expecting at least a couple people to come, you know, from the religions classes and uh, geography classes like that. We feel like it's, it's been an all right turnout. Students who attended were allowed to ask questions after during the Q&A. The speakers are, are great, you know, they are very intellig intelligent on the subject, so I feel like uh, the students are going to get a really good, uh, good speech and good information from them that is legitimate, and uh, I am very grateful that a lot of people showed up. I think by learning about um, Islam, what it means to be a Muslim, and uh, the world view and the Quran is going to be beneficial for uh, for everyone. Sorry, Galal Abdul Wahab and uh, Abdul Basid, and also Saifuddin Horton, they're, 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 they know a lot in their field, and we feel like they're, they're going to get a lot of information. They're going to they're gonna leave better, well equipped than they did before, you know. They'll have more information under their belt. MSA has decided, since the turnout was so shockingly positive, that they would hold the same event again, possibly next spring. The men of Collegiate 100 hosted UTC's first ever Stroll for a Scholarship, March 28th. NVHC Greeks joined together in the Howard High School Gymnasium for the night's event with special guest appearance from the Delta Sigma Theta Sorority from Alabama and the Kappa Alpha Psi Fraternity from Knoxville. The competition was tough between the Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity, the Omega Psi Phi Fraternity, and the Zeta Phi Beta Sorority as they competed in three rounds. The Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity walked away as the winners of the stroll-off, awarded a trophy and $250. Collegiate 100 President Aaron Eccles informed us that all proceeds will be going to a Child of the Boys and Girls Club.